This is a 1957 Plymouth known as Miss Belvedere. This car has gained a lot of fame through its time because it's known as the time capsule that was buried in Tulsa, Oklahoma in 1957. A brand new car had zero miles on it. This here car, the idea behind it was to bury it and whoever guessed the population of Tulsa in the year 2007 would receive this car free of charge. Some of the theory behind this and why Tulsa wanted to do this car was when they buried this in the year 1957, they dug it up 50 years later. Tulsa was celebrating their 100th year of adding to the union. So that was a lot of the theory behind what they did behind this here car also. When they buried the car, they went through a lot of expense. They went and made a special concrete vault but she got a crack in it through time. And uh, when they pulled it out, this was what they seen. She was pretty bad shape. But the theory was really good, the thoughts were good, because like I say, she was buried in the courthouse lawn. Well, the person that won this car, uh, they were deceased. So they went and followed up to the next of kin. And they were quite of age, and they didn't want the car. Well. I got approached and said, would you like this car for your museum? And so I did some studying on it and I thought, oh my, what a human interest story. So I contacted them back and says, I would love to have this car. We're adding on the museum. I'll make a special room for this car. I'll make this car talk. I'll be really good for Tulsa. The whole part about it is great. So we did that. We got the walls to talk. We got everything here. And we cannot believe the amount of visitors come here and travel from all around the globe and a lot of people from Tulsa especially. We're getting all kinds of people to see this car. And I, I kind of feel that this is a good thing for historic auto attraction. I think this is really good for the city of Tulsa. And this time capsule, she's still got zero miles on her, but people love to come and see it just for the stage it's in. And we're proud to have this car and I just think it's it's a neat piece of history. Thank you for watching our video. Hope you get to see you soon at Historic Auto Attractions at 13825 Metric Drive in Roscoe, Illinois.